This is one of Detroit's most dangerous buildings. But years after falling into disrepair, there's little to keep people, including children, out. Thanks for being with us here for the News at 6. I'm Kimberly Gill. I'm Devin Skillian. Phoenix Multicultural Academy hasn't hosted students or teachers in years, but its crumbling structure keeps drawing visitors. The school closed back in 2016 due to low enrollment. Then in 2019, fire broke out at the vacant school. In fact, one firefighter suffered smoke inhalation and had to be hospitalized. Yeah, now it's marked for demolition, but it's unclear when that demolition will happen. Sean Lay is live outside the building on Lane Street, just east of Spring Wells. Sean, neighbors there are worried something worse than a fire might happen. And we can really show that you that vividly. This was once a safe place for kids to come and learn. It's now wide open here. Detroit Public Schools, they're responsible for this place everywhere. It's a huge building. You can see every window wide open here. Uh, the kids playing up on the roof will show you that. Fires, multiple fires. Neighbors say this place absolutely has to go. We're asking Detroit, Detroit Public Schools when that's going to happen. Phoenix Academy was a beautiful school in southwest Detroit. This is what it looks like today, one of Detroit's most dangerous buildings. The school was shut down in 2016, and since then, there has been fire after fire after fire, including a fire this week. In 2019, one fire left a Detroit firefighter in critical condition. Phoenix Academy is wide open and is a public health hazard sitting in the middle of this neighborhood, attracting kids nonstop. One filming this TikTok of what this place looks like inside. Phoenix Academy is a wide open daily danger. During one fire, a mom who does not want to be identified could not believe kids were playing on the playground as this place was on fire yet again. I see the smoke coming out the door and I'm like, yeah, it's on fire. So I called it in and they're still continuing playing as the fire is being put out. We found out who's responsible for Phoenix Academy, Detroit public schools. We asked them when this danger is being demolished. A contractor has been selected, but neighbors say they can't wait one more day. Here's why. Jaw dropping drone footage showing this kids right on top of this building and scampering down the roof access hatch. People here fear someone is going to get hurt or killed. Back here live. Now, Detroit Public Schools Community District got right back to us today and we said, what is the deal with this place? They said, yes, a contractor has been identified to take it down. Can't give us a date when it's going to come down. They also want to build a new school here, but again, can't give us a timeline. Neighbors say it's got to go right away. I hope the school district in the city sees the video of the firefighters getting hurt and then also the kids on the rooftop, guys. We'll put that video on our website. Click on the Detroit.com. Really dangerous stuff here. That drone footage, just amazing, yeah. Sean. And we know, Sean, that DPSED has tried to secure the building. And they showed me how, and they're really frustrated because a building inspector also came out today and the school district says, look, back there, every window is covered up by this nice thick plastic bolted mm -hmm. on there. And as soon as they put it up, it gets broken down. Uh -huh. One more thing. They also put up, look how shiny this is, a brand new fence. Brand new fence to wall this off to make it more safe. Fence has been stolen. Incredible. Incredible. Okay, you'll stay on top of it. We know, Sean. Appreciate it so much.